Hey everybody, thanks for watching the video today. Um, I'm out on a local lake a little bit north of where I live. Um, and today I'm targeting panfish with a dead stick I'll put down here in a little while for some walleye or pike swimming through for the prime time bite. Uh, it's about 2.30 right now. I'm out just testing this new setup I've got. As you can see, I'm in a different shack than I was last week. Um, got the ATV out here. Yes, I've got enough ice for an ATV um, on the lake that I'm on. So I'm pretty stoked, excited. Um, it's going to be a good day, hopefully. We're going to throw a minnow head down on this guy. Go from there. Little shiner. Oh, well, here we go. First fish of the day maybe coming in. Let's get down there. Here we go. This is back to our normal slaying and praying. Let's see here. Oh, oh, she's on, maybe. She tried. She tried. That's the juice box right there. Got him. Got to tighten the drag up a little bit. Ooh. Uh, probably a bluegill. Ooh, nice crappie. First crappie of the ice season right here. Right here. First crappie, ice season 2020, 2021. Nice. Nice. She is a little bit small though. But let's uh, measure her since she's the first one of the year. All right, what do we got here? Mouth shut. We're talking eight and a quarter eight and a quarter inches nice we'll see you later go get bigger so we don't want to cross lines too much here but let's get down they're hugging the bottom if we hit bottom and come up a little bit they come flying up here we go Oh, I missed it. Here he comes back, maybe. Here he comes. And they're not hitting it. I wonder if they took the bait. No. It's right there on the tip. Let's try this hole. Let's go a different hole here. Let's do a different little strategy here. See if we can't pull some from over here on the left. See, you can see the fish coming in. Grabbing my jig and boom. Oh, missed him. They are missing. I don't know if it's spinning or what the deal is. We're going to throw the K-Rip down. This guy's got a little treble hook. And we're going to see if we can't make magic happen with that. Oh, I put it in here, I think. Yep. There's the waxies. Let's grab it. 
this is a much better spot it looks like the fact that we've even got crappie in here is great all right so this is the new guy i'm using we got this this is just a tiny little k rip i'm not sure exactly which k rip it is but i've got it just on a little bit of a, a little snap there or a quick quick snap is what these are called treble hook waxy little perch color it looks like we will drop her down and you can see on the screen there she goes free falling and you'll see the fish start coming in see this this guy's got a little rattle in him too which just excites it look at me just pull him up boom look at that lost him these must be small or I'm doing something wrong, which is possible I'm doing something wrong. Let's see here. Here we go. Coming up. Grab it. There it is. Ooh, bluegill. Nice. First bluegill of the ice fishing season. Right here. Right in the lip. It's the way you like to see it happen. Come on out. There we go. Nice fish. Nice fish. Real small little guy. Not even seven inches. Looks like. Seven and a quarter. Not bad. We'll let him go back. Well, at least we're getting in the fish, right? <laughs> Boom. On. Little bluegill. There we go. Seven and a half inch, probably, bluegill. Little guy. This is the good luck charm. First one of the trip. While I'm out here, I should show my setup. This is the... New guy, set up with the Otter Shack, all set up. He's great, two up, I love this thing. Here come the crappies, hopefully ready to eat. Got him. Crappie. Nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Small guy. He fell off. Here he is, though. Nice little crappie. Nice. Little crappie minnow. So let's do it again. Did he miss it? I think he missed it. Yep. Didn't miss that one. Same fish. Missed one, went for the other. He's hungry. Here we go. A little bit better sized crappie. Nice. I like. Let's just get this out of his mouth. Oh, on the drop. 
Nailed it. You guys should have saw that. Ooh, it's a little bit better one. A little bit better guy. Come here. Ooh, definitely better. Definitely better. Look at that. Palm sized. They're coming out. Look at this beast. Nice crappie. Nice. Nice. What do we got for a measure? That's right, buddy. Mouth closed. We got ten and a quarter. Oh, it's pushing ten and a half. Go on. Lives to see another day. Give her a drop. As soon as I see something starting to come in, I stop and then I pull up a little bit, jig, just to see if that little rattle maybe helps out. But well, you can see it in the camera here still too. Here we go. Watch this. Jig, 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 stop. Jig, 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 jig. See, he's not coming closer, which is interesting. What if I go closer to him? Yeah. That guy didn't want to play. Here we go. Wait for it. Got him. Nice. Nice size crappie again. It's probably good eight and a half, nine. Eight and a half inch crappie. Nice one. Go back to see another day. Come on, scared him away. There we go, we got one. Nice size crappie. Nice little guy. Probably seven and a half inches here. Let's get him back down. Probably about seven and a half inches. Nice crappie. Here we go. Another one, another one bites the dust. You know, usually I'm not a big minnow fan, but they, they're they working tonight. Jig and minnows, jig and minnows. That's an eight and a half, eight and a half inches. Jig and minnows is working. You got to keep her that time. I'll show you again. Using this uh, ultralight rip and wrap uh, number three. It's like a yellow chartreuse white back. I don't know if it actually glows or if it's UV. It does glow. I will try to show you here. Let me get it glowed up. And then I don't know. Yeah, you can see that. That's what we're using tonight. And it seems to be working. Half the time I've been forgetting to actually put the UV light on it and glow it up, but it, it's working. So we'll go back down again. There we go. Nice 
nice size crappie. Another eight, eight and a half or probably. Nice size. Love catching me crappies. Okay. He got a little dinner too. Look at that. All right, back down. Slade. Man, he got that thing. He came. Look at that. That's how he came up at it, straight from the bottom. Boom. Only way he would have gotten that in the mouth like that. Incredible. And he lives to see another day. And so does my minnow. So I'll try to get some camera footage here. I think, uh, I'm sorry, some live scope footage. I think I screwed up my screen recording. It's really stupid the way Helm works. You, you can't screen record on the device, on the chart plotter itself. You have to do it through the Active Captain app, through the Helm function, which you do through your phone, through Wi-Fi. And you open it up on your phone, you click record, and it starts recording, and it'll record for however long. Your phone can't fall asleep, number one. And number two, you can't have it rerunning in the background. So if you get a text, you get something else coming in, you change the screen over to something else, it stops the recording. So I apologize. Earlier, you didn't get much of the footage that I was hoping to give you, but I'll get you some more tomorrow. Here we go. They're all about that same size. Eight and a, eight and a, oh my gosh. Eight and a half inches, which isn't bad. These are great, these would be great to eat, but it's too late in the day. So today is just catch and release. All right, that was a fun day. Uh, actually caught some fish today to show you guys, so that was kind of cool. Had a little snafu with the screen recording though for you, so next time I promise to get that right, do a little bit better job with that. But if you like this stuff, um, I'll be back out on the water again tomorrow. I know it's gonna be a while before you guys see these videos because I'm still working on the editing part of this stuff. But uh, thanks for watching and we will see you later on the ice. Take it easy.